there, there is an obvious reason for what it was that enabled humans to make that escape. And that is language. Because what language enabled the, the coalition of the subordinated males to do is to make a plan, is to make a plan. And now all of a sudden, they could convert their individual tendencies for proactive aggression, which are not enough, into an alliance, an alliance. Because they've got to be able to work out how to approach someone and suggest this idea, you know, to float the possibility of killing the offender without themselves being exposed to the possibility of being shot to the offender and themselves being killed. But I think the ancestors of Sapiens must have been the ones whose linguistic ability, for whatever reason, got to the point of being so sophisticated that they could dare develop the sort of plan to get rid of the supreme bullies. Language, an alliance, to get rid of the supreme bullies. Language. I think that once you have the ability to safely execute using the absolute power of an alliance against a victim, you also have the ability to control society through social norms. Language. To control through social norms. Language. So they are the supreme dictators as a group created a world in which they can specify what is good and what is bad, what is right and what is wrong. They have created a moral system, a moral system, the system of justice, religion, politics, the systems of law, ultimately going back to alliances among males who have agreed among themselves not to have any kind of alpha male, the supreme bullies, and who then have the power that they can impose throughout society. Language to control society through social norms. Language to control through social norms. Language.